Hope everybody's doing well. I know I am going into the uh, the new year and uh, got a lot of things planned uh, for the channel. Try to get this thing going. I'm using my Canon RP today, so the quality is probably going to be a little bit better. Uh, I'm having problems with one of the lenses that I'm using, and uh, it's a uh, it's more better for like low light situations like this anyway so how is how are my people doing out there is everybody holding the course oh let me get my coffee got the coffee it's back so i wonder what you uh guys have planned um going into the new year so far if you got any resolution uh new year's resolutions that you may have uh, wanted to adhere to. I'd like to hear maybe from you uh, how that's going. I think what I'm going to do with the channel, I'm going to incorporate uh, not so much, well, there's going to be recovery involved, obviously, you know, alcohol and maybe some other things uh, that people are having problems with are certainly welcome. Uh, but what interests you? Uh, what what kind of things do you do to keep your mind off of, um, you know, wandering into that danger zone? Um, I know that I, you know, as you well know, if you know me, that I'm into photography. And a little later I'll show you uh, some of the cameras that I use. Um, obviously it's not a film camera that I'm using for this, but it's my main camera, my main working camera. But really, what what do you guys do? I mean, I know I know some of the people um, in recovery do yoga. Uh, they knit. Uh, they play golf. I mean, I I haven't played in a while, but I I certainly that was a while, and that's all I did. Uh, but there was a lot of drinking involved. I mean, you get to the nineteenth hole, what do you do? You drink. Talk about it. you settle the bet. You drink. Talk about your swing. You drink. Mostly beer and all that, but you know, I'd like to know what what you guys uh, what you guys do. Um, occupational wise, I know uh, there's a lot of people in recovery uh, that may have had their jobs affected. Um, I know several. Uh, I know it's affected mine, and um, just it 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 keeping you know your head out of that that stinking thinking you know as that has been said but you know like i took a walk yesterday because I, I just i hadn't been out of the house in a while so it was time to you know put the feet to the pavement and just just go around the block a couple of times and look at ugh, you know the christmas season is over but look at all this junk people still have in their yards i mean uh, one or two, you know, I admit, I we got some pumpkins still out there. I don't know how they survived. From October to now, I mean, they should be rotten. And they're still, you know, they're not, they're not, you know, piles of seeds and, and innards. <clears throat> that being said, you know, I used to surf a lot. So there may be, I need to start picking that back up. But I certainly I don't do it in the, uh, in the wintertime. Not anymore. I just I couldn't take the cold. But getting back in the water, dusting off the board, getting a couple of dings repaired. Uh, those are, you know, slight indentations uh, that exposes the foam. I don't want the water, you know, getting in there. Especially when what I paid for the board. It was not a cheap board. Uh, the golfing thing, I'd really like to start swinging the club again just go to the range try to put my swing back together see what things are doing i'm starting to eat more you know starting to gain a little bit of weight you know that i lost so that's that's positive um i it, you know when you're drinking or your your mind is not where it needs to be we tend to neglect certain things and nutrition is important and my eating habits have been horrendous you know at times so you know, it's time to that be like a good new resolution. Mr. B 
is going to work on his nutrition and calorie intake and whatnot. So it's time to uh, to start doing that. I never was a smoker, so I mean, there's a lot of people I know that are trying to quit. You know, that's a New Year's resolution. Trying to quit smoking, I can imagine what it's like being. And I mean, I've socially smoked, you know, in the, in the past and everything, but but. From what I've heard, you know, stopping smoking is like one of the hardest things they've ever done. Like even with patches and tablets, gum, you know, whatever. I mean, there's a lot of different ways to quit nasty habits. But I've heard that, that tobacco, you know, sometimes I dip tobacco here and there. But I've never, it's never been a uh, super thing for me. But I'm playing music. You know, I got a collection of guitars, and I think I picked. It, and you may hear some. I may start playing some music on the channel. Uh, certainly, don't want to go ripping anybody off. Um, the music that I use on the intro was of a band called Crosswire out of Detroit, and they were pretty ahead of their time. Um, like the intro with the clouds, like on the on the channel, very innovative kind of REM ish slightly progressive whatever but those are like 1985 when when they came out with a couple of records that they they had done i think they did fairly well like in that detroit area a friend of mine that was a marine corps was in the marine corps at the time uh and we were into skateboarding that's another thing um but he was the one that turned me on to them but just you know like surfing maybe get back on the skateboard just cruising around Definitely getting out and shooting more photos. Uh, my folks are having a 1969 Dodge Charger. It was my father's first car when he got out of college. Uh, he had the thing custom ordered. It's been sitting in the garage for a really long time, and they went to Greenville today to see they've been. They're getting like pretty much a top or bottom down, top down, whatever what you call it, restoration and. They've sunk a lot of money into it, and they wanted me to go up there today, and I contemplated on going because I was thinking about taking some some uh, film cameras up there and shooting, but um, I, I decided to just hang back, clean up, make a video, and because this is another thing I'm doing, you know, creating the channel and making videos. Um, but aside from that, I mean, I just like to hear what's what's going on, and I'm going to be, I've been sort of holed up, and I'm tired of all that, and you know, just kind of move on. But it's, I think, 2024 is going to be a hell of a lot better than last year. I hope to God that it is. Last year was pretty rough, but I will see you around, and stay tuned. Yeah, the first one is a, this is kind of be a hard to do, because my, it's an Olympus, Stylus 120, those are pretty popular now, got a plastic point and shoot Ilford, a Minolta that I got from a friend, same person that sold me the Olympus, got a Miranda here, and no, another Miranda, this was the camera that my dad gave me when I was a kid let me, that I learned to shoot on. Various lenses. Here's some interesting stuff. I got a Polaroid. That's like a one-step old instant camera. And this is pretty interesting. This is a Instamatic. Super 8 movie camera. I don't have any batteries or film for it yet. I want to take it out. 
This is the oldest camera I got. It's a Brownie Hawkeye. I think it was my grandmother's. Then of course, bag of film. Gotta have that. Camera's useless without it. Gotta keep it in the refrigerator. See you guys later.